Hello and welcome to the mystery of the wonky print. So far, my prints, uh, well my, see, that is a, a 3D um, SD card holder. That's what it's supposed to look like, something like that. But as you can see, it's not flat. Um, done another one, and again, it's not square and here's another one you can see it is it's supposed to be in a straight line it's like supposed to be like flat both all the way around but uh but i found a salute uh, the solution see i think there was a missing uh grub screw there that I'll show you basically that's what it looks like and that's a spare one and there's a motor just there you can see just there and what you've got is the timing belt gear that show you that that there fits onto the motor there and slides down as you can see and there's a grub screw that fix it on so to prevent it from but so but prevent it from sliding I don't know if you can quite see but anyway it's in there but as in this diagram as you can see so no, for some reason that was missing so I've got what this grub screw from here, spare one here fitted it on so now hopefully I'm going to try and reprint the uh, SD card holder and let's see what happens let's slice it Print it. Online printing. What's happening now? Starting to do it properly this time. Let's just give it a few more, a bit more time to see what happens. A bit more. I think it's, it's made a tiny mistake, but I think it's just just where really about there. It's a bit of a mistake, but. It, it's just doing okay. I made a slight hole in it, but I think it's just going over the hole. It's so far, so good. It's curving up the hole right now. So far so good, nice and straight all the way around, that's what it's supposed to be, look like, uh, 
55 minutes left. Printing time, yeah, 55 minutes. Full square. That's not how it should look like, so it's not all. It's uh, looking a bit bumpy on the side. Another go. It looks even, that's even more bumpy, but yeah, so compare. And all of because it's not printed straight because of this piece here. It is the grub screw. As you can see, it was missing for some reason. So when that goes back, it's like sliding to like. No, it's not sliding. That's what it should look like, you see. And that's it. and it's fitted well. Like that, but looking really good now. As I look at more look a little bit later. Got about 30 seconds to go. 30 seconds to go. And so far it's looking pretty good. Eight seconds to go. Printing successful finished in 2 hours, 45 minutes and 14 seconds. Okay. Temperature 181 degrees. Uh, heat, fruit bed 57 degrees. So let's take off the bed. Off. Made a bit of a um, bottom there, but that doesn't really matter. Look, it's all nice. This is how it should be. Uh, these are the other ones it's done. Uh, let's see. Then that one. So all of these should fit in lovely. Let's see how good this is. So I think I've now, as I said earlier. All of because of those, that missing uh, grub screw, that's why it wasn't working. So what I'm going to do now, well not now because it's quite late, but before I do my next print I'm going to put, put like this, should go there. 
Um, I've got that cover that goes there. There's that lid that goes on. There's that what goes fits on top. And then this goes on top. Fix it onto there, and you've got the dust cover there. So I'll do another video about that. Basically, I think I fixed it, so it's now all working order. So thanks for watching, and I. Video and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.